Monday, live now in Vancouver. Eight years ago, Tessa Virtue and Scott Moyer in this city won Canada's last Olympic gold medal in skating. First Olympic dance medal was the highlight of the career. Finished second in Sochi, recently had an undefeated run, then they finished second at the Grand Prix Final, which put some doubt in a lot of skating fans' minds, and maybe even in their own minds. They went back to the drawing board. Yes, they did, and they looked at their free dance and uh, really questioned as to how they could improve it and what they what they really thought, if the, anything they could do to overtake the French team uh, for the Olympic Games. And uh, they came up with a plan. They're adding a little bit more more lyricism, romanticism to their free dance, finishing a bit more on a high. Um, and it has looked fantastic in practice. Technically, they were also beaten in the short dance at the Grand Prix Final. And really, Rod, that's about taking care of the details. Tessa and Scott still have the highest score in their short dance this season. Um, and in order to get those kinds of numbers again, they need to get the levels across the board. And that's what they will be looking for here at the Canadian Championships, making sure they've got the technical requirements. All the talk has been about their return to skating, return to the Olympics, hopefully a return, as they say, to gold. And they talked about the tweaks after the Grand Prix final. There were some changes that we wanted to make, and it was mostly just tweaks. Um, we really do love these programs, uh, but we felt like there are some opportunities for us to just make small changes that would open the program up. Um, we felt like we needed to skate a little bit more, cover some more ice, and uh, just have a bit more confidence and command. Uh, it was funny when we watched the video of us, it didn't feel or it didn't look like we felt. You know, we felt confident and then it just looked a little rushed. So, kind of taking the time and enjoying it. That free dance, the Moulin Rouge free dance tomorrow. Virtue and Moyer, this has been their era. They will cement their legacy. Well, it's interesting. You talk about back in Vancouver when they won their first title. And at that point, you could see their potential. And you really wondered, would they realize it? Um, and, and you knew that their potential was to be one of the all-time great dance teams. And I would say, without a doubt, they are the greatest dance team the world has ever seen. Whether they win gold or silver, uh, when they go forward to... Uh, South Korea, it's just incredible. Their body of work, their versatility, their longevity, there's there's no other team that can uh, can equal. That's Tessa Virtue and Scott Moyer. High praise from 